Imagine a swarm of tiny robots pollinating crops. It sounds like science fiction, but it's real. Scientists have created bug-sized flying robots designed for artificial pollination. Watch this report to take a closer look at this incredible innovation. Scientists from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, or MIT, have developed bug-sized robots that could potentially revolutionize farming. These tiny robots are designed for artificial pollination, making them especially valuable in high-tech vertical farms. The robots weigh just 0.8 grams, that is less than a paperclip. Moreover, they can stay in the air for about 1,000 seconds. That's around 17 minutes of flight time. These robots can also perform high-speed acrobatic maneuvers, including double aerial flips. So our approach is that we really start from building 0.1 gram, very lightweight artificial muscles that can be very power dense. So with that, we combine like flapping wing structure to the muscle so that we can achieve very compact and lightweight um, flying robot system. MIT researchers hope that sometime in the future, these tiny robots can pollinate crops autonomously outside the lab. I mean, this doesn't really mean that we want to entirely replace honeybees in nature, but what we sometimes hear from the people in the relevant field is that there are really the cases where we can't rely on honeybees anymore, you know, such as like indoor farming, where we can't really have like like honeybee comms in it because of like safety issues or some environmental issues. So in that case, we can start thinking of like using our robot, you know, if it works well for those like indoor farmings. Despite the improvements, the robotic insects are still a long way from matching up with natural pollinators. Researchers aim to improve flight time and precision to enable them to land and take off from the center of a flower. From double aerial flips to artificial pollination, these bug-sized bots are demonstrating the incredible potential of micro-robotics. While they may not be buzzing around our fields just yet, their development marks a significant step towards a more technologically advanced and sustainable future for agriculture.